Paulie Malinaji here for Paulie TV. Pumping gas down here in Florida. That's how we do. And the M4, we only do super unleaded. That's how we do, baby. Anyway, and El Alvarez, what are we doing? Some mighty nice office here. We have Dimitri Bebold and Gennady Golovkin from the matchroom side. And then we have from PBC, the offer is Jamal Charlo and David Benavidez, bro. I don't know, bro, but I'm, I'm, I'm leaning more towards PBC right now, as you can see. I'm leaning, we got the train ruining, the train ruining the whole record. Honestly, bro, I'm, I'm leaning more towards PBC right now, bro. Um, I, I've been, I, I just, not that I don't like the challenge from Bebo. I think Bebo is a great challenge. I, I just think he's too big, and I just don't like guys trying to fight off more than they can shoot. Not that he can't beat Bebo. I, I, I listen, I think Canelo versus Dimitri Bebo is a good fight. I just think it's a bigger guy. He can punch. Um, he's also very busy. Canelo is not the busiest guy. He likes to take his time. And against guys his size, you know, he usually can control the pace a little bit better because he's so strong at his natural weight. But against guys bigger than him, I don't know. I just, listen, man, I, you know me. I, you don't play boxing. You do boxing. I just don't like that he, he takes all this risk. Um, not that I say he can't handle it. Um, obviously, Gennady Golovkin, uh, the, the third fight on the end of that is also, you know, pretty interesting because just because the first two fights were pretty interesting. Although I think Golovkin is a little bit older. I like the PBC side better. You know, I think Jamal Cholo is his biggest threat for a guy his natural size uh, at middleweight, super middleweight. And David Benavidez is also right up there, right up there along with Cholo as one of the biggest threats for, some, for Canelo's natural size. Again, I just like the natural size battles. I like them at a, at a super middleweight, the natural super middleweights, uh, although Charlo will be coming up. I think Charlo is the most skilled guy Canelo can face right now. Um, I don't know, man. Let me know what you guys think. I like the PBC offer. I mean, $100 million each way. I mean, that's you can't go wrong regardless of the choice you make. And Canelo has some options for some great fights. They're all risky fights. They're all tough fights, so you can't knock them for, for, for taking easy fights. That's for sure. Um, I don't know, man. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna enjoy it either way, fellas and, and gals. But I'll tell you what, for me, I prefer the PBC offer, Charlo and Benavides. Not to knock the matchroom offer of Bebo and Golovkin. For me, it's just more interesting. And also, maybe it'll help Charlo stay out of jail because you know he needs a he needs a reason to stay focused. And this is the perfect reason to stay focused. Is the Canelo fight? Let me know what you think. That's I'm Paulie Malinaji for Paulie TV.